Have you ever wondered about the first man on earth, Prophet Adam, and how his story unfolds? Imagine the birth of humanity, starting with a single individual. This is the tale of Prophet Adam, the first human being crafted by the divine hands of Allah. In a realm beyond our comprehension, Allah meticulously shaped Adam from clay, an element of the earth, symbolizing our profound connection with nature. Once the form was perfected, Allah breathed life into this clay figure, sparking the miracle of existence. But this creation was not only about life, it was about honor. Allah, in His infinite wisdom and grace, commanded the angels to prostrate before Adam, acknowledging the special place of humans in the grand scheme of existence. This unique creation marked the beginning of human life and set the stage for a fascinating journey. The story of Prophet Adam is more than just a beginning, it's a testament to our divine origin and potential. After his creation, Adam was not left alone. So, what happened next? Let's delve into that chapter. Adam found himself in the company of Eve, or Hawa, as she is known in Islam. Allah, in his infinite wisdom and mercy, created Eve as a companion for Adam. Together they dwelt in paradise, a place of peace, tranquility, and an abundance of blessings. Now, imagine a life where every need is catered for, every wish fulfilled, and harmony prevails. That was the life of Adam and Eve in paradise. But with all these blessings, there was a single command from their Creator. They were forbidden to eat from a specific tree, a single rule in the midst of boundless freedom. It seems simple, doesn't it? However, life, whether on earth or in paradise, comes with its own set of trials. Yet, even in paradise, there was a test to be passed. Despite all the blessings, a single misstep led to a drastic change. But what was this misstep? Well, despite the blissful surroundings and endless blessings, temptation found its way to Adam and Eve. A figure, cunning and deceptive, known as Satan, spun a web of deceit around them. He promised them eternal life and unending rule, all hidden in the fruit of one tree, a tree they had been explicitly forbidden to approach. Yet, the allure of his words, the promise of more, led them to cross the boundary set by the divine. They ate from the forbidden tree. In this act of disobedience, they lost their place in paradise. The consequences were immediate and severe. They were cast out, banished from the tranquility of paradise and sent to earth. This act of disobedience led to their expulsion from paradise, marking the beginning of human life on earth. Now on earth, Adam and Eve had to navigate a new life. So, how did they cope? Following their fall from paradise, their hearts were filled with remorse. Adam, in particular, felt a profound sense of repentance. He turned to Allah in humility, seeking forgiveness for their transgression. Allah, in His infinite mercy, accepted Adam's sincere repentance, demonstrating the boundless compassion that characterizes the divine. This experience taught Adam and Eve valuable lessons. They learned about the consequences of disobedience, the power of repentance, and the limitless mercy of Allah. With these lessons in their hearts, they began their life on earth. Despite the challenges and hardships they faced, they persevered, their faith serving as their guiding light. Their journey set the stage for all of humanity, marking the beginning of our shared story. From this story, we learn the importance of obedience, repentance, and the mercy of Allah. So, what can we take away from the story of Prophet Adam? This narrative serves as a reminder of our own humanity, our susceptibility to temptation, and the importance of obedience to the Creator. It shows us how Adam, the first man, was not infallible and succumbed to temptation. But crucially, he also sought forgiveness, demonstrating the power and necessity of repentance. The story of Prophet Adam underscores the mercy of Allah, who forgave Adam, teaching us that no matter the nature of our mistakes, forgiveness is always within our reach. It sets the foundation for humanity's relationship with the Creator, a relationship marked by obedience, repentance, and mercy. It is also a testament to our purpose on earth as beings created by Allah to strive for righteousness, seek forgiveness when we falter, 
and always remember the mercy of our Creator. Remember, every story from our past holds valuable lessons for our present and our future. Until next time, stay curious and keep learning.